need that. Do I want to go up here? No, I can't. I couldn't do that with. Uh, I mean, both my bathrooms have been redone over the uh, in the last seven or eight years. Um, my bathroom downstairs is too small. Anyway, you don't need to know why. I've researched it when we were remodeling both, um, and it wasn't plausible. Is this locked or not locked? No. We go this way? Yeah. Okay. You have old pedestal sinks, so you feel your pain. Yeah, I mean, my one bathroom is so tiny that I needed to find the right uh, vanity to fit and give enough room for, like, you to sit at, at, the, at the toilet and stuff like that. So there was very limited options of what you could do. And uh, I never did it upstairs either. I think it was price because you can't a lot of the sinks and stuff like that that you get at like a Home Depot or a Lowe's or something that's commonly available and have stuff like that look at tall round building, tall round building. Is. is that what it is vessel sinks ah okay vessel sinks I was calling it a basin We're just gonna, we're just gonna start in with this. Oh, wait, there's a lot. Oh, there's a. There's another zombie we can set free. This guy turns around. We're just gonna, all hell's gonna break loose. Hey, look. We got away with it. over there look at Chester over here got some I'll look into it yeah he looked into it all right I want to set you free. Come with me. Go. I'll watch your back. Damn. Wait, what? Kill that here. That was not the gun I wanted. All right, let's take the rifle out. Uh... Oh, crap. Not what I wanted to do. I, <laughs> I fired when I wasn't ready. Where are they? 
There's somebody over there? I'll go see what's up. Ah! There are people everywhere here. Go! Get around her! Oof. Don't let her escape! Not, try <laughs> Not trying to escape. How come I keep getting this gun? that mine didn't blow up. Hmm, this is a tough section. There's a lot of them. Porta potty. Uh, <laughs> there goes my mine. <laughs> I see. Oh, I hit the railing. You can hit the railing. Oh, shit. I can't hit through that. I only have three shots left. There we go. Maybe we can let this clicker loose. The Rattlers are very heavily armed and armored elf on a shelf, that's for sure. Can we let these guys go? else shooting at me. I don't even know where it's coming from. This is hard. I don't think I'm going to let these clickers go. I mean, it's a cool little trap that they set up. Possibility, but I think I've killed most of them. Alright, let's go. Tape is full? What? It's the first time ever. Oh, and I can't even make anything. Hey, I can upgrade the weapon. That's good. Perfect. Alright, let's go. Got him! Here. Oh, oh yes. She's out. I'm out of that weapon. Yes, you're right. Very observant of you. No more heads. You have no hands. No, you have no hands. Ooh, fresh lettuce. She's gonna. I would admire all the produce, honestly. That's a nice head of lettuce you got there. Okay, Ellie, come on. Let's do this. You're gonna 
We're gonna Rambo through this whole thing. We're gonna take everybody out. Look at all the ammo. Look at it all. Wow. You heard it, huh? Yeah, you go check it out. That's gonna go well for you. She's behind me. Wow. Close this door. They have me in an advantage position. This is a bad position. All right. Don't kill me. Woo, that's close. Let us admire it. I like it. All right, I think that's it for now. Can't stop, won't stop. You gotta channel your inner Lucio. Note. Note. Jenny, sending along some extra beef. <laughs> I don't know. I just didn't expect him to say that. Grapefruit and potatoes are just gone. They've been impressed with how many strays I've captured and want to reward me. We're making the best crop we've had since we settled here. Please make sure my mommy gets fatty cuts. She looked too skinny last time I saw her. I was not expecting to read that. Okay. That's fine. Hey, look. More of those. Uh... Can't remember what they're called. What kind of things are they called? I want to say basin again. Vessel. Vessel sinks. That's it. Annoying. What do you mean by annoying? Should I take the bat? I guess we should take the bat. So this is just this was just a, a loot excursion over here. How do I get up here though? Hmm. Oh, okay, place. There we go. Up and over. All right, no, that doesn't do anything. Okay, so there's gotta be a different way in here that I didn't see. Did I miss the way to go? Hey, Gojo Sam, what's up? Aha! Guy's terrible at his job. Shut. Terrible at his job. <laughs> Who just leaves like uncooked chickens on the grill? I have to swap weapons here. Um. Want the bow, maybe? Oh, 
boy. Oh boy. I know what I need to do. Well, that was a lot of people in there. I was not expecting. I like one health. Let me hear the sweet sound of my explosions, please. Thank you. That was terrible. Mr. Axe Fighter. <laughs> they sent the melee guy in first. I feel that. I feel that. I hear running. Over there. Whoa, wow. Over here. Well, that shot worked out well. Nice. What? All right, you're tough. Not that tough. All right. Uh, anyone else? You're gonna find me, huh? Any more? That got a little close. A little too close for comfort. I like these traps. These traps are great. If they have like another trap, tripwire or something, then I'm gonna run right into it. <laughs> I hate how she goes through doors without even looking around first. Dead end. Wait, what did I do? Uh, okay. It's this way. Oh, hello, prisoners. Oh! At least it was just a bat. Oh, right in the bad part here. Oh, right in the eyeball. Oh. Right, come on, let's go. Hey, well, where's Abby? She's bit. Keep back. Hey, don't put that fucking thing in hey, me. Hey, 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 hey. Abby tried to escape. She's down in the pillars. Where's that? The pillars? Head down to the beach. You won't miss it. I just was at the beach. She's probably already dead. Come on. She's like, I already killed everybody. Like, you guys can relax.
All we need is an Ottoman cup to drink to our sponsors. Oh, I think her wound was reopened too. She was literally like need in her side, right in her wound. Yeah, that'll keep everybody busy. I love how I love how uh, Ellie can literally just come into this camp, uh, come into this camp for the first time. <laughs> and just create so much mayhem within like 20 minutes of being there. Can you imagine Ellie and Abby teaming up? Well, I don't, while I don't imagine that, they would make a very good team. You know, you got your warrior and your rogue. All you, all you then need is your healer and your wizard and you're all set. Oh God, <gasps> the pillars. Abby. Oh God. <sighs> that totally looked like her for a second. I hear coughing. Can't go up here. It's her? It's you. I can't believe that's her. She does not look. <laughs> She's been here for months, right? I would doubt she'd be able to stand. Is this Lev? <gasps> no!
I can't let you leave. I'm not doing this. Part of this. You made him a part of this. I don't even want to do this. Any choices here? gut-wrenching to, 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 like, be a part of. Like, why is this happening? I don't understand. This is crazy. Punches. 
Oh God! Oh! That was really hard to watch and play. Oh, she lost two fingers. See, and the thing is, like, how does she come back and even say anything? Like, did you do it? Did you finally get your piece you were hoping for? She's like, no, I let her go. Like, what? You were gone for months, lost your fingers, and like, and now you're still gonna be tormented by all this? Like, the people, <laughs> Tommy and Dina and stuff like that, like, how are they gonna react to this? They're all, they're gone. They're gone. Did she lose everything? Making that journey? stuff is still here. It's kind of hurt to. That's kind of suck to play guitar. Uh, 
Now she can't do all the friends. She has to learn to play the, with her other hand. Which would be really hard. Wow. Drinking coffee. Where'd you get that? Uh, those people that came through last week. Oh. I'm a little embarrassed as to what I had to trade to get it, but it's not bad. I had Seth under control. Yeah, I know. And you need to stop harassing Jesse about my patrols. Okay. Uh, Dina. Is she your girlfriend? No. No, she... That was just one kiss. It doesn't mean anything. She just... I don't know why she did that. But you do like her. <sighs> so stupid. I have no idea what that girl's intentions are, but... But I do know that she would be lucky to have you. You're such an asshole. I'm not trying to. I was supposed to die in that hospital. My life would have fucking mattered. But you took that from me. Somehow, the Lord gave me a second chance at that moment. I would do it all over again. I don't think I can ever forgive you for that. But I would like to try. See you around. 
Yep. <clears throat> Whoa. Wow. Where's she going? I don't know. I would assume she would go back to... Is it Jackson? But, I don't know. I want to be on, in the, a fly on the wall when she tells Tommy where she'd been the last couple months and what happened. <laughs> it's not going to take that very well. Whoa! Um... Whatever you think you know about this game or any other game it's, it's a it's a personal thought right how you feel about something and how somebody else feels about something to be different but what i will say is um not many games evoke emotions not many games are moving whether it's positive or negative emotions uh, this game and this franchise makes me feel a lot. <laughs> it's hard to kind of describe, like, exactly how I'm feeling right now. Um, and, you know, the story's got flaws and things I like and things I don't, but right now I'm just feeling. I'm feeling a whole bunch, and, um... I have to respect any form of uh, media, whether it's a book or movies or a show or theater or video games that causes real emotions to stir, so. Yeah. Um. Wow. Wow. Hey, Quo. Third game has that team up we all want. I do. I do want Abby. I do want Abby and Ellie to talk all uh, everything through and really just share their sides with each other. There's, there's a part of me that wants that, but there's a part of me that would feel like that would be very contrived, you know? I don't know how that would work out, but yeah. Yeah. Um. Let me just make sure this. Is there is there an, uh, is there another scene or anything after this? You don't know. This game is like I thought this game was over like 17 times, so. Um. 
No other scenes, yeah. I'm trying not to uh, I'm trying not to read your comments yet before because I'm still processing. Um you guys some of you guys have had the benefit of maybe playing the game or watching other people play and then perhaps like reading articles about the story and hearing other discussing with other people and all of those layers of the experience you know, will change how you feel about the game, right? You might play through it and feel one way, but then read somebody else's opinion and think something totally different after that. So I'm trying to kind of form my own thoughts. Um, first of all, I will say this. I feel like there's probably a lot of people out there um, that like the game and some people that don't like the game and some people ex wanted the game to be one thing and they got another thing well regardless of how you feel about it love it hate it one thing that i would just ask everybody in general to just keep in mind when you're discussing things like this other people like you your opinion even if it's really really strong you don't have to change other people's minds about it you know if you love it don't feel like you have to defend it you know, and if you hate it, don't feel like you have to rain on other people's parade when they express that they like it. Because <laughs> I've seen that going around like so much. You know, not even like spoilery stuff with the game, but just like pe people trying to convince other people that their opinion is is the right thing. <laughs> don't need to do that. You can feel what you feel without trying to change what other people think. Um, but in general, um... Yeah, I don't, I don't necessarily know if I absolutely love everything that just happened, especially at that end. Because it feels like, all right, if Ellie's going to be this hell-bent, uh, that she's willing to give away this ideal life on this farm with Dina and the baby, if she's willing to give that all up because she's so tormented, right? And she's so, like, she has so much post-traumatic stress syndrome, like, difficulty dealing with that. Uh, that she goes on this mission of revenge and then she you know she goes through all of that and lets them go at the end it feels like all right well what was the point of that a little bit but at the same time looking at the scene um at the end on the uh on the beach you know when she discovers everything it's kind of like You wouldn't have wanted Ellie to do... Like, I didn't want Ellie to go through with any of that. When she was there. So I don't even know, like, how you... I don't even know how you, like, fix that. There's that point... Like, that pointless journey. But then if she actually did it, I, w I, I think I'd feel worse. So it almost... You're almost kind of painted into a little bit of a, coin, a corner. Um... So I don't know what they would do at the end of that to make it feel better. Um, yeah. Yeah. It's tough. Um... My guess is that Ellie needed to decide, not Tommy or Dina, so the trip was needed for that to occur. That's that's not a bad way to look at it, Eldon. She she maybe she can come to terms with it after. I don't know. Yeah, it's a very very sad story, Zari. I agree. I agree. It's not a feel good game. The first one wasn't a feel good game either, though. Um, talk a little bit about my thoughts on. Uh, perspective and I, I saw some people saying stuff like you know Ellie's the evil one or you know I can't stand Abby Abby's such a jerk and you know whatever and the thing is like everything a game like this puts it to the extreme but everything is about perspective 
You know, I, I, I think I said this yesterday. If the first game was about Abby and her dad and her dad trying to find a cure for this and the first game was all about Abby and like that thing, then, you know, Ellie would seem like the bad, you know, really, you know, the person you hated in this whole game. And why am I playing as Ellie? It would just, it would totally be flip-flopped. Um, you know, it's the same thing that we all kind of, you know, go through. We all have our own perspective on things and we all feel like, you know, if you take a second to walk in somebody other's, somebody else's shoes, I think that's really a big point they try to drive home. Take a walk in somebody else's shoes and uh, put yourself in their perspective. Yeah, Helvetica's right. Evil is a point of view. Sure, that's awful. That is awful. Sorry that you went through that. Yeah. So anyway, um, I enjoyed the, the 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 actual gameplay, like the combat and the and like the upgrading the stuff and the exploring and the you know the graphics and all that. That is like super stellar, top notch. And like I said, I really have an emotional attachment to you know a lot of the characters in this whole franchise. I'm not sure I you know completely love everything they were doing with the story or what they were trying to tell with this game, but I respect the story that they were they were telling. So. Um, I don't know. I don't. I don't think I'm gonna be able to totally like know how I think about things until I have a, a little bit of time away from it. But it, it definitely, definitely made me feel. <laughs> I definitely felt. 